Hey guys, welcome to Scanova's YouTube channel. In the last video, we showed you how dynamic QR codes can help you track the exact GPS location of each scan. In case you missed it, the link is in the description box. But guys, tracking GPS location is not the only feature of dynamic QR code. There's loads to offer. For example, you can password protect your QR code, just like a PDF or a document. So you're wondering how this feature is useful. Let's take an example. For example, it's that part of the year when you have to release your annual budget and you want to share this information only with selected authorized person. So guys, what do you do? You create a QR code, you store the information in that QR code and then you add a password to it. You add this QR code to the last slide of the presentation or the print material. So when your end users scan the QR code, they'll have to enter the password to have access to the content encoded. So in this video, we will discuss this awesome feature of password protection of QR codes. So let's talk about password protected QR codes. This feature helps you to protect the content of your QR code. So you simply have to add a password to your QR code and share it with the people you want. When the person scans the QR code, he or she would be redirected to a link, but the link can only be accessed once they enter the password. So if the correct password is entered, then the stored information can be accessed. So the next question is how to set up password protection in a QR code. So the first step is to create a QR code. For this, you will need a QR code generator tool. Guys, make sure that the QR code generator you choose has the password protection feature. So what do you do? You go on your browser and search password protected QR code generator tool and you'll get the list of results. Obviously, you won't click on every link and see which suits you best. Don't worry guys, we have a video in which we have compared the top most QR code generator tools. The link is in the description box. For this video, we are using Scanova's generator tool for demo purposes. For this, we need to go on Scanova's website and click on product. Then go to QR code generator. Here, you need to sign up for a free trial for 14 days. A window would prompt where you need to enter your name, your email address and your password. Now you will land on a page where you will see multiple categories of QR code. For this video, we are choosing website URL QR code. Click on the website URL QR code and now enter your website link. Now click on create QR code. You will see a window pop up here. You can change the name of the QR code and you will see the option of add password protection in advanced settings. Click on the option, enter the password you want to save and click on save. Now you will be landed on the page where you will see three options for QR code. The first one is the standard QR code. If you want to start from the scratch, go for this QR code. The, in the other two options, you can customize the QR code. In case you are a serious marketer, customization of QR codes would help you increase the scans. In this video, we will take custom background design for them. Once you click on customize, you will land on a page and you will see various customization options. For example, you can add a background image, you can change the data pattern, or you can also change the eye patterns of the QR code. Once you are done with designing, click on update. Then click on download your QR code. You can see your password protected QR code has been generated. So friends, by now you know the password protection feature and how to enable it. But do you also know that you can actually change the password that you encoded? In fact, you can also change the content stored in the QR code. Remember guys, it's a dynamic QR code and can be edited and updated. So you can change the password or the content in some really easy steps. So now, go to Scanova dashboard and click on the option of save QR code. Go to the QR code you want to change the password for. So now click on the option edit and edit your password. Once you've entered the new password, click on save. You can also change the content of your QR code by entering a new website link. Now click on update QR code. So now your password protected QR code has been updated. So guys, your QR code has been updated you will see that it has the same pattern as that of the earlier QR code. So there's no need to reprint it. So isn't it so easy to create password protected QR codes? Hope you found the video helpful. In case you have any queries, write it in the comment box. We'll be happy to help you. 
and guys do not forget to click on the like button and subscribe to Scanova's YouTube channel.